Yes, yes, y arriba la América. Guys, this is Dawn Jackson Blattner. She's the host of the new show, See Chicago on WGN. This show is where we check out the best shopping, entertainment, and events the city has to offer. And today we're at Maxwell Street Market. Dawn's gonna do a little shopping. I'm gonna do a little cooking. Then we're gonna meet back up and eat some tacos. Tac tac, yes! Cause I'm checking out Ruby's at Maxwell Street Market. All right, Evelyn, let's talk about Ruby's and where you guys came from. So we started at the original Maxwell Street Market at 14th and Canal, uh -huh. selling produce. And then grandma planted the seed to, you know, you should sell food. Every week, once the weekend comes around, it's like Sunday. Yes! It's time for Ruby's tacos. And we can't wait for Sundays to come just to have our quesadillas. Yeah, one day a week just is it. But if it was here available every day, I think I'd be still here every day. Yeah, that's the truth. <laughs> what makes Ruby's the place to come, the only place to come for tacos? For us, it's not just feeding customers, we're feeding families. Family. If I'm gonna be treated like family, you gonna share those recipes with me? Well, you, you know. Can <laughs> you think about it? We'll let you try some out. How, how about that? That's pretty a good you know? place to start. I mean, Who am I gonna cook with today? Oh, with my dad, Gilberto. Okay. Um, Mr. Ruby's. There you go. That's the beautiful That's sound. him right now. What was he saying just then? He's telling you the whole menu in English and Spanish. Wow, that was. There you go. Yeah, he is. He's and definitely doing yes. that. <laughs> yeah, I think I heard Al Pastor in there somewhere. But before I take on the famous Trumpo, I need to meet Maria and make some homemade tortillas. This is Evelyn's mom. She's going to put me through the tortilla process. You're going to grab a small amount of masa. Okay. And then do it like this. Now we're going to crush it. The big reveal. Oh, but no. Oh, no. Oh. Maria, I'm embarrassing myself. That's how we learn. You're a classic mom. I love that. Yeah. You say you're encouraging me. Maybe I'll have better luck slicing the pork with Alberto. Now we're with Dad, Gilberto, and he is the master of the Al Pastor. Yeah. But you're gonna have me slice some, right? Yeah. Gilberto's coal fired Al Pastor is best sliced thin. Really? Good. He likes it. <laughs> he likes it. He likes it. And pan fried till crispy. Can you teach me how to do the menu? Yell out the menu? Yes, 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 yes! Yes. Hay tacos y quesadillas con flor de calabaza, huitla cocha, no pales, hongos al pastor, lengua en chile verde, mole rojo, rajas con queso y chicharrón. We, we sell all, all the tacos. <laughs> While Gilberto finishes up, I'm gonna go talk to some fellow taco lovers and then meet back up with Dawn for a bite. Dao Pastor, that's what they're known for. It's really delicious the way they prepare it. It's like actually prepared right in front of you. It's a little bit crispy on the outside and inside it's so, so smooth and so tender. The marinade and the meat, the bits of pineapple. Pungent, smokier flavor to the Pastor. It's like a romantic explosion is kind of what it is. Only another man could say that the tacos are romantic. <laughs> yes, yes, yes! So thanks for coming back. Thanks for sitting down with me. Looks delicious. Did you have fun shopping? So much fun. There's so much to see here. This is the famous Al Pastor. I can't wait. How pretty does it look, first of all? Oh, well, it looks beautiful, but I'm ready to dig in. OK. She's worse than I am. Mm, that charcoal, the way it sings the outside, so leaves a smoky taste with the additional amount of pineapple. That's a dynamite combination of Al Pastor. I love the handmade tortilla, uh -huh. but I also love that the spiciness is not like killing me. Like I can still go in. It's almost as if they have 20 years of experience and grandma's recipes. <laughs> on our show, we thank our fans because they're the ones who send us to these places. So we need to thank Nick and Sean on Facebook. A plus. We have plenty more reading to do, but stick around because Dawn's new show, See Chicago, starts right now. You should probably go. Yeah. Well, can I take these with me? Yeah, sure. Right. No, leave them. <laughs> I'm taking them. All right, guys. Okay. Thanks. <laughs>